Some studs wear the wow, some studs wear their dildos to the club. Like you so tell them to the print. So now we in the club too. <laughs> he said, to, he said to sell they print. Ah, man, you imagine you pulling them draws off slow, and then you see that. <laughs> I'm, I mean, I'm gonna be honest. Like I said before, I mean, it's, it's nothing like I've never seen before. So I have my thing is you, you, you do what you got to do. I guess I've been dealing. That's stopping you, Kev. My nah, pussy work. My pussy work. Ain't gonna stop. You a single man. Ain't yeah. gonna. So ain't yeah, even going to begin to slow me up. If it ain't going to stop you. It ain't even going to begin to slow me up. It's, exactly. Man. That boy is disgusting. Yeah, um, like, yeah. All right, Instagram Rap. is up and running. All right, Instagram is up. What we here? That was just a... That was just some behind the scenes shit. We're going to put somewhere else. We can't put that shit on YouTube. Oh we get banned God. for fucking life. So... What we t- what so... We t- go ahead. So... I'm so, Go listen. Ahead. <laughs> so listen, Kev was talking about a very interesting post. Okay. Other than the one with the girl with the uh <laughs> with the popcorn kernels in her pussy. So he was talking about how odd it is that how many studs, how many studs killed their girlfriends in the last year? In the year, I don't know. I don't know. Average. I don't know. This nigga is saying this stuff. Don't know the average. I, I don't. I mean, I don't know the average. I didn't. I just said it was crazy. Um, they were showing a uh, a fucking thunder going on upstairs. Crazy. They were. They had a post with a bunch of studs. It was like eight or nine studs that had killed their girlfriends. I don't know if it was within the last year or so, but it's a phenomenal number about how many studs actually kill their girlfriends. You know, what I mean, each year, and then these people are like, some of them are people of power. You know, what I mean, police women, police woman, what? what? Was police woman, right, Kev? Yeah, I, see I sent you. Yeah, yeah. You yeah. know, what I mean, and I and they have their story on there, and some of them got the text messages, and um, and it's just, you know, it it just shows that toxic love doesn't just happen. Within men and women, you know, what I mean, it, it can happen within uh, no matter if you're with a man, if you're a man with a man, a woman with a woman, or a man with a woman. Wait, uh, just... wait, He's how saying. many people, how many men do you think killed their lovers, their their man lovers? Oh, that's, a, that's out there a lot. That happened a lot. No, motherfuckers getting exposed, motherfuckers about to expose them. They have a no, no, no. I mean, I mean, relationship though, like not committed just relationship, guy. committed relationship because that's a that's a fight. Like, you're gonna have to take that at shit the end of the life. day. They niggas. at the end of the day, you a nigga at heart, right? Don't right. get, get the built up, mm-hmm. nigga, right. niggas gonna fight. It might not be a nigga. It could, could be your, could your gay be- lover kill you. <laughs> I don't have a gay lover, so <laughs> if you did, no, if you did, nah, I don't even want to wait, wait, not even gonna go there. wait, wait, <laughs> wait, 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 <laughs> that motherfucker got through a little bit too aggressive. You caught me a motherfucking ass down. Like, I was nervous. Your, your dick right I was on. nervous. I got into a fight with her. <laughs> this motherfucker looked like she could take a punch. And she and she strong. And she dodged so, him too. She quick on her feet. Yeah, you know I mean, <laughs> motherfucker scoop slammed me. I'm like, so when did you find out that she was a man? <laughs> nah, she ain't no man. She had kids. <laughs> Every job produce kids in the period. Ain't no catch up <laughs> on that tampon. <laughs> so that, that brings me to a I good know. question. And and I know we talking and we're gonna we're gonna really get into it because I'm really I'm really interested. It, it brings me to a question. And this is this is a serious question. I want y'all to realize the seriousness of it. And I and I'm not this is theoretical. This is me just asking. I'll I'll say the same thing. Like I won't leave y'all out there. 
Okay. If you got into a relationship with a woman, you didn't do any sex yet. She wouldn't let you do any sex with her. I know it's about to get crazy. And you found out that she was once or born a man. <laughs> yeah. Somehow. You went here. What yeah. what would be your next reaction? You she didn't lie to you either. She didn't lie to you. She ain't say nothing. You know what I mean? What is he's your deceased. next reaction? He's, a dece he's deceased now, but I had that happen to a family member. I mean, I had it happen about you, but all right. Nah, yeah, yeah, about me. Good. I had to had happen to a deceased uncle. They, they, my uncles used to tell me a story. I fucking was dating, dating court. You know, this is back in like this sixties or seventies. But you know, they were just dating, and you know, before you have sex back then, you had to be married. So he doing everything, and he's happily, you know, about to get married. He finally gets married. He takes her back to the room. You know, just the first time he ever gonna have sex with it. She said he reached up under the skirt. This is the story he told my other uncles. This is my great uncle. Reached up under the skirt and just grabbed the hold of it. Said it was bigger than his. This nigga went ballistic. Wanted to kill the motherfucker. Had to go get divorced that day. Mm -hmm. Annulment, probably. Yeah. Yeah. I'm like, damn, nigga. Like, how? How you ain't know, but you got, I look back and I look at people like Florida Evans. Them was some strong face looking women back in the fucking day. Oh my so God. it probably was a lot harder to tell because there was some strong face looking just out of slavery bitches back then. I'm, so I can understand what this nigga went through because he was, you know what I'm saying? He was like strong face women back then. So he just probably didn't know this one got lost in the shuffle. So what would you do, Kev, if you right. found out? Right, <laughs> that the person oh, that man. you were talking to or dating was actually a man. What would you do? I'll tell you what. All right, I'll tell you. I will take a bleach bath. I, 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 I would probably man. feel like I would probably go through the same motions Ace Ventura went through when he found out Einhorn was a man. <laughs> <laughs> you know, what I mean, that's ex that's the only way that I could think of how my reaction would be. All right, the relationship is over you know what i mean yeah of course and and if you're saying that this person didn't lie to me i'd be i'd be really upset with myself because it's like bro you you don't know better you don't know the difference you know what i mean like either that or this this woman this person who's a woman now is really good at what they do <laughs> you know what i mean but yeah, I'd feel like Ace Ventura. My clothes would probably be <laughs> in a can lit on fire. I'd be in the shower. Probably I'd probably cry a little bit to myself. <laughs> you, <don't have> to. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like what would yo, you I would that's a good question. I would definitely tell you know you what, off. and I wouldn't I'm make a, fun of you. I, I wouldn't make fun I, of I would ex, I would expect it to happen. You can't tell me no, I wouldn't I will laugh. I will I laugh. wouldn't make fun yeah, of you until you. I until I realize if you're okay with it because that shit could like yo, this nigga could have probably killed. You know, that's why you know God, you know, God bless the dead, but a lot of them get killed. Yeah, or either that or they or they threaten to like you know expose the person. So my thing is like I unless this nigga's okay, I'll be like, yo, you all right with that? Like if you need to talk regular, we could just talk. And I'll give you an ear and I'll say whatever. But if you are cool and you like, nah, I didn't go that far, then yes, the jokes. Yeah, yeah I I jokes will come. I <laughs> the jokes is coming. I, I, I would expect the jokes to come, but but the but that day, the when it happened, like no, I don't you don't even know the emotions that you would actually feel because I don't know how into this person I would be, and that would determine on how much you know, I would be looking in the mirror, person? like like don't nigga, love her. What Don't the love her. fuck? You know what I mean? You can always get back with that person. What are you saying? If you, you said the clothes are strong, nigga, you always get back. Yeah, but Listen, I didn't have go sex take pay for a surgery, get it all oh, done. That date, see, and hey, that's yo, where right, and that's yo. where the murder, that's where the murder part Commences. probably come. Yeah, because the day that you actually are like, oh yeah, I'm about to hit that. And then you see there's a baby elephant trunk there. Nigga, oh you don't God. know. The only thing you know to do is it feel like you need to be in a self-defense class. You know what I mean? Like, God. am I being right there? I'm, I'm about to say, you on? probably, overhand right is probably coming. I mean, it's, yeah, it's just out of, out of reaction. That's dangerous, know? man. That's it's dangerous. It's, dangerous. it's, it's yeah. very dangerous. And that's why I tell, like, we got friends in that community. Like, I'm I'm hoping they're always open with the people that they're dating because I don't want to ever read that somebody that I'm cool with 
mm-hmm. that's in that lifestyle getting, you know, what I mean, murdered because it'd be fucked up. It really will be fucked up. Yeah, because you really can't. As your emotions as a man, you'd be upset, especially if you was like you kept saying you was talking for a minute. Maybe she gave you some head. The best head you ever had. I, think, I was about to say, I think that's like a common thing, if I'm not mistaken. Like, that's how mm-hmm. niggas get caught the fuck up and they get because it's like, oh, she did that. She did that because she ain't want you to see that she ain't have. The yeah, and then, then you be questioning, then you be questioning yourself. And then you be yeah. thinking, like, do all niggas give a head like this? <laughs> I'm just saying. Today's sponsors are brought to you by Ideas Unlimited. Do you have a birthday party coming up? Maybe a baby shower. Could be a wedding party. School's letting out. Could be a graduation party in mind. Ideas Unlimited has it all from custom 360 booths with backdrops to a personalized throne chair with centerpieces. You like snacks? Everyone likes snacks, am I right? Get your snacks custom made with your face on it. Ideas Unlimited can do it all and more. Get all your party needs at Ideas Unlimited. Your party one-stop shop. You can contact them on Facebook and Instagram. Ideas Unlimited. I'm just saying. Is that what you would ask yourself, Kev? <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh. you be sitting on the edge of your bed. Do all niggas give head like this? That, because... that is the craziest <laughs> shit. <laughs> this, is why, this is why women stay gay. Like They're getting the best head from somebody who knows their body the best. So I think there's an important question there, uh, right? Just because would that be rape? Oh, that'd be rape. That's because you didn't agree. Rape. You didn't agree to that. I didn't agree to that. I didn't. I don't like, know. I was under the false pretense that you were a woman, right? That would constitute probably. That's what I'm saying. That's why it's dangerous because it's like, yo, that can lead. That's a good question, yo. That yeah. can lead to you discovering what's on the other side after life. You okay. you will have a first hand experience with that shit, because mm-hmm. I'm just saying it, it ain't gonna end well. I, it just it just it just it's like like I don't know how they do it nowadays. I don't know. That's I'm glad I'm out of the dating game, but I hope that's that's people, what makes you that's what you was worried about when you was dating. Oh man, I, hell yeah, I worried about it. nigga. You ain't worried about that shit when you was dating. Yo, Crazy honestly, guy. I'm gonna be honest with you. It literally has never crossed my mind. I feel like I have. Yeah. They they talk about having gaydar. I feel like I have. Like, I feel like I know where to go. <laughs> I know your history. That I guess that's why I always dated people that I knew for a long yeah. time. I guess. Like, all right, hey. I knew you from back in the day. I know your baby people. Your baby pictures. Hey, at. hey, hey! Listen, I know my cousin. You've been a girl. I, my, I know my cousin <laughs> watching. I ain't gonna name you by name. But you you had a couple of moments where nigga we had to rescue your ass like hey and he knows I love him I ain't don't name his name because I love him to death I and had to say that. hey you the only one who bring it up yeah I, I will bring it up I was you like oh, we was in the club man because we was in the club one time man niggas talk about having gaydar it's like <laughs> that's what Dre said he had he had he can tell. He was in the club one time, and we was just looking like we got this. It was a club where we just got this vibe, this funny vibe. Like before, I like you know me. I get in a club, I want to dance. But when I got in this, they club, like that, Kev. They like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. I got a. I just just <laughs> this vibe. The, the vibe was just off. It was just something that you can feel like. Just, oh, God. I don't think I'm supposed to be in here. My gator. And I'm looking, yeah, I'm looking, I'm looking, I'm looking around, and I'm looking around, and I'm checking the scenery out. I'm like, it's a lot of tall ass female in this motherfucker that got flats on. They tall. All right, yo. So listen, listen. I'm this is a god honest story. It's god honest story. So we in there, we chilling. So my cousin sees a Puerto Rican joints, two of them, two tall Puerto Ricans. <laughs> Long hair. Yo, you already fucked up when you said two hey. tall Puerto Rican chicks. Oh, oh no, Mexican. Long, very, very long hair, but very <laughs> slim. They're not really. They're slim, but you know. So he like, damn, look at that over there. So he was like, where over there? I look. That's a big motherfucker. Keep looking like, like yeah, man, it's bad. Me, me, and my little cousin tap each other like, yo. Something wrong. You're like, yeah. 
My third cousin, he stayed damn they bad. I looked at their shoulders, I'm like man, that, them shoulders are squared the fuck off. <laughs> all right, all right, dog. No, listen, bro. This is the shit I'm seeing because he keeps telling me to look. So I'm looking. So I look at the height. I already got the vibe. So I look at the shoulders. The shoulders is big. The next giveaway is each day I'm about to go holler. We like hold up. Look at the motherfucking hands. Niggas know niggas' hands. They got these big niggas got big veiny hands. Like they hand women hands don't have the veins and and the hand the hands is big and they veiny. And so they got like yo exactly. I'm like yo, bro, cuz stop. No, now I'm about to go over there. Look, man, she bad as shit. Puerto Rican. All you see, all they see is this hair. Don't get it twisted. There are People who make that transition that are just pretty dudes that just make that uh, listen, Paul. That, no, that, that's pause. a fact. That, niggas been fooled, not that's physically, a but on online. You've been fooled. Come on now. Yeah, exactly. Fact. They hit the pause. He's he's about to go over there. I look at the feet. This nigga's tall. He's big ass hand. This nigga got on a size 13 flat. <laughs> <laughs> Nah. As soon as he went, we grabbed him. Nah. Nah. Nigga, look. Nigga, look. Y'all talk about... No, nigga, look. Look around this club. Just look. You see another nigga dancing, this little white Russian nigga dancing. He's a little motherfucker. Another big six-foot motherfucking female over there dancing, rubbing all on this fucking Russian dude with these big-ass hands. Same situation. Tall as fuck with flats on. Not hills that make you tall. You got flats and your feet long as shit. Wrong spot. Didn't realize we was in, I'm going to tell you where we was at. We was in AC. It's a club called Kiss Kiss. It's a known gay bar where a lot of trans, you can go in there straight, but it's a lot of transgenders, a lot of gay dudes that go you up go in this club. Go in there straight, you but you meet gay? <laughs> Nigga! Once we got to looking around and seeing shit and we started noticing shit, y'all love yo, we like, yo, we gotta get the fuck up out of here. We gotta get the, we so gotta get the fuck up out of here. Like, like, nothing against this, like, that wasn't our twist. And I'm not saying it's wrong for anybody, but I'm like, it's too many big six-foot motherfucking females in here with long ass flats on. Like I could understand they tall and they got heels on because of, you know what I mean? A five, eight woman, a five, nine woman with heels on, they're almost six foot with the heels. The heels give them that extra six inches. These niggas got flats on and they long as fuck. They look like, like, uh, speeding Gonzalez shoes or some shit like that. And she got the Ooh. Bugs Bunny feet. Like they just long. 13, a size 13 shoe is all I'm going to be dubious. I'm going to be like, Nigga, Why your feet so big, like that don't make Nigga. sense. Let me let me get a I look grab, at you. I had to grab Cuz, like yeah, yo. Neck. When I grabbed Cuz, he, I say, nigga, look at what we looking at. Big ass feet, big ass hand. Yeah, she's slim. She's slim for a reason, nigga. Ain't got much titties. Ain't no ass. Ain't no hips. It's big shoulders. No, we up up out of here. Shit ain't right. Look at look at the Russian dude in the corner where she rubbing on this nigga with she's palming this nigga whole entire head. She palmed this nigga head. This little Russian nigga just over there thinking he in the best. I said, we out. You think it's we cool out. to dance with him? You could dance with him. That's not that's not hurting anything. Not the way Kevin left, bro. <laughs> not the way I left, I left that club, son. Not not it's not my Kevin. it's not my twist. Like I don't knock nobody for doing it. I'm gonna ask you. A, you know I'm what I'm saying? We can party. We can party together. Hell yeah, we can yeah, party, we can party together. Party. Yeah, yeah. Shoulder to shoulder party, cool. All right, yo. <laughs> so like you the over shoulder. there, I'm here. We like having a good time. Part. I'm cool. That's that's we partying. It's partying. It's just we having a good time. When they're drinking, we partying. Kev, you don't want to dance. I ain't with grinding you on you. Do a game of one on one after. Yo, and you lose <laughs> every <laughs> you time. Lose. Guaranteed. Got a better, got a better hook shot than you. Now, let me, let me ask you. Let me ask but you. Let me ask you. Yo, in I'm that about club, to ask y'all. Oh, go ahead, go ahead. I'm sorry. You, you wouldn't know. know. You, you would have had to be because it's dark. The club is dark. It's a lot of like strobe lights going off. You talk. You f- like. You gotta look. 
Like shit, niggas, I started looking. I got the vibe you talking about. I just started looking at everything. I'm looking at this whole club, this whole not a not a lot of dudes, a lot of Russian dudes, a lot of white dudes, a few like you can tell they're gay dudes, gay men in here, a lot of women, and women that are, are women are with other women. Yeah, I said we in the wrong spot. Yeah. Yeah. That's why the niggas when y'all when y'all gave y'all IDs at the front, the niggas just laughed and gave it back to y'all. You good? Yeah, shit. The niggas say you good. I don't know why you giving me these. <laughs> I don't want to know who any of you are. <laughs> yeah, yeah, so uh, listen, man. The spot was jumping. I was just I just got the vibe like I'm not dancing in here. I just yo, uh, if if somebody you know, like I'm not gonna say your cousin. You kept saying because I ain't um, gonna say his name because I well, love him. Let's, to let's, death. I, we know, we know. All right, okay. Yeah, um, because <laughs> you gonna fucking say it. Nah, I'm um, not gonna say it now because I love him to death. But it was funny. He know who he is. He hear he hears this story. He's laughing right now. Yeah, because y'all saved him. But let me ask you. Let's say some random person was in the same um was in the same position and he wound up doing something with somebody. Do you then? Now this is this is in my brain going. And this person, I don't know this person. Hold on, hold on. No, no, you you know him. And they got, let's say the person got the surgery, right? To get their shit removed. Do you then, because I know this is a this is a weird question. Do you then consider them to be gay? No, right? If the person got the surgery. This is a question that people be asking. We the, we the podcast that asks the questions and gives our opinion. Mm. I would say, yeah, because it doesn't change your chromosomes, right? No, 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 no. The person, the person, your friend that did it, or your cousin or whoever that did it with the person that got the uh the surgery, you wouldn't consider that person to be gay if they wound up doing a sexual I, I, right? I don't know. I was like, nigga, you just fucked the dick hole. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay, now I'm getting what you're saying. So your friend has sex with a a man who was transgender who actually had the surgery and now is fully a woman. Correct. I don't know. I wouldn't consider my friend to be gay. That was just like, yo, he, no. she, yo, he got you or she got you. Yeah, I mean, I wouldn't he consider you, him bro. to be gay because don't, don't go do nothing with her. Don't go like beat her up or do nothing. She got you. Just, Keep it to you. yourself. <laughs> she got yeah. you. Yeah. Just know we, me and you would never have jokes. Don't ever joke with me because I'm going to eliminate you. Hey, make sure both of y'all shit is uh, your privacy setting is changed. Yeah, so yeah, I can yeah, get you I always want to know about my privacy. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, but I'll be like, I'll be like, no, I don't. The jokes will fly. The jokes will fly. I'm like, I'm like, nigga, you know what you did, right? But yo, don't, like, y'all, yeah. no, no, that gets you, yo, y'all yeah. fight. Y'all niggas would fight. Yeah. <laughs> like, yo, he beat, I like, he beat you up. Yeah, and Kevin fuck around and make the joke in front of a party. Kevin, Kevin fuck around and say that joke in front of a party of people who don't nah. know nothing about it. Yep. You know what I mean? And then nah, I, have, I have jokes on my cousin that was yeah. in that situation. Yeah, but he ain't have jokes on that all, all the time. He didn't go. He all didn't all the way do through. it. He, exactly. he didn't do it. We saved him. Yeah, like, I mean, I, I think we that eventually, him. if he did try to do anything, he'd realize, like, wait a minute, something ain't right with this scenario. Yeah, you know what I mean? That. He was he was just looking from behind on the verge on the nah. verge of going to talk. He, he, say, get, he, he didn't even get to first base yet. You know what I mean? He didn't even grind up. You might say fuck it when you that drunk. You might say fuck it. He might even grind up on that bitch. No. Hey, what hey, up? Hey, what up, yo? I'm giving hey, no it ever gonna know. Like Damn, you, up, you, yo. you snuck a gun in the club? <laughs> <laughs> yo, where you gonna? Yo, where you gonna? Where you gonna squishy gun from? <laughs> it's that new shit. Is it new metal? Elon Musk made this joint. <laughs> oh. <laughs> nah, see that nigga, he would have swung. Like we would have got arrested that night because the nigga would. That's the type of nigga would have just been fighting. It'd have been a brawl. It'd have been over. What's so, I, fool, so, so, so to me, right? To me, it leads me to a couple other questions. One, one would be, I think we all know the answer to this one. Is it okay for a man to fight a transgender woman? I say, yeah. Me and you was born with the same set of skills, the specific skills that I use to, you know what I'm saying? To whoop your ass. Do you think it's the same applies with studs? Is it okay for a man to fight a stud? 
I'm not a violent person. Yeah, I'm about to say. I'm, I'm not, but I'm, I'm, I'm in my confidence. If I'm not, go ahead, if, you if, talk first. If a if a stud was trying to fight me, yeah, press you, I'm, press I'm, you. I'm, I'm 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 gonna have to put hands and feet, but I'm not gonna I'm not gonna go crazy like it was a dude. Like you know what I'm saying? Once once the knockout happened, poof, it was like yo, I told you to chill. You know what oh. I'm saying? Somebody please help <laughs> this young lady up. She, I, but then we gonna have to fight, but nah, you're not big. What if I'm you with a full no. on brawl with a stud and she eating yeah. shit and she, and she scoop you doing the fight? And hey, yo, uh, that's crazy. This, says, yo, Dre, this has happened. Jump, hey Dre, do we jump into that point? Can't get his ass with nah. my stud? Nah, nah unless <laughs> she's stomping, unless she's stomping him out. If she's stomping him out, yeah, we gotta put hands and feet on her. But other than that, that's just the L. I would expect y'all to do the same. Yo, that's the L yeah. you have to take. That'd be the first fight yeah. you get to. I'll be in full laughter. You getting your ass with. That'd be the first time I That's laugh. You get your ass with. <laughs> Kevin's a fucked up individual. Yo, she yeah. start beating this nigga with the dildo. Where does a dildo come from, Kevin? Why does it always end up sexual? Because some studs wear the Wild some studs wear their dildos to the club. So you so tell they can show the print. So now we in the club too. <laughs> he, said to, he said to sell they print. <laughs> Listen, let me oh, tell you, that. let me tell you something, sir. <laughs> Find me right now a stud that wears the dildo. No, not a dildo, excuse me. Where's the strap on to the club? The strap, the strap on hard, nigga. <laughs> the strap on is already hard, so that means that shit is poking. Find me one that wears one to the club. Find they them now. I see the bill, motherfucking shit. They wear that shit. Yeah, to it show was a porn, print. nigga. <laughs> you, you watched a porn, and that's what nigga. you saw. Yo, it's a, yo technically, it's a, book technically of that shit's so tough, and she start losing. That's something hard to hit you with. All right, bro. You need to be. You I'm need just to be saying. Can you imagine, yeah. this nigga? Yeah. <laughs> nigga, smell like fish the whole ride home. <laughs> Just at right, this yo. Nigga. Hey yo, what? Yeah, they not gonna let us ever. We never gonna get on. <laughs> no, we never gonna. Nobody's ever gonna fuck with us. Oh shit! The gay community oh, not gonna shit. like you, bro. Ah, yeah. oh, it's cool. You're not. Man, a, you're not an ally. Community. You're not. I am always an ally. I'm always for the gay and community. Always, as always, the views of <laughs> Kevin Durant are strictly the views of <laughs> Kevin <laughs> Durant. <laughs> I make y'all feel. I make y'all feel a part of the community. I love them. Like, listen, I got yeah. a lot of. I got listen. I got a lot of gay friends, cousins, family. I love them all. They, they, did they the any of them tell you? Did any of those gay friends or family tell you that? Studs wear dildos to the club. Yeah, yo, I was watching the video, dog. No, 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 no. That's not the question I asked, dog. That's not the question I asked. Did any of them tell you that? I was watching no. the video. No, I've been watching no. the video. Studs says, no. "Yeah, I wear my I wear my strap onto the club so they can no. show the print." I'm like, wow, like that's some shit. Like I never even thought of that shit. Maybe I should do. I'm just saying. <laughs> I'm just saying, maybe I should do the same thing. If women take their wigs off at the club, I'll get it like a dildo put it show. I got a mean print. Get home while they take their wig off and pulling that shit out. Like, yeah, you they fake me. You say that was all your hair. I fooled you and said this was all my dick. We both in the back predicament. What we doing? I mean, <laughs> that's a that's a fair thing, though. I mean, yeah, we just... we gonna you gonna take them booty pads out? Yeah. It's... Now what? Yeah, we both lying. Now what? Yeah, we, we already there. We and already here. Orange is to play with. What are we doing? <laughs> we we both figure there. it out. Yeah. But I'm saying, <laughs> but yo, no, like, I'm so glad I've never had little dick problems. Yo, I'm so yeah. glad. <laughs> but but uh, I'm a, I'm get a back. grower, not a shore. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, taking us to the next level. I'm a grower, not a shore. Uh, I told my wife that. As you told her. Yeah. I'm so, so sure. would you fight a stud, Dre? Like. If she listen, I'm gonna be honest. If you on that man shit and you and you pressing me, I might get I might because my thing is like, listen, I'm a man. This is about to get real sexist. I'm a man, you're a woman. We are both born with different, <clears throat> we're born with different strengths. It just is what it is. Some of them are some of them are fucking strong. But if you pressing me, I might have to give you one to back you up. If I can't back you up, then you'll get the full, you'll get the full Monty. 
I'm gonna have to, I'm, I'm just gonna have to beat you the fuck up so that you can understand there is a difference between you and I. Yo, I'm telling you, man, you're gonna be in the fight. Some of them can fight. I've heard of niggas hey, getting beat up by, by studs, bro. Just I've hacking, heard of that. Nigga just ha- get hanged. Like, listen, I, I me personally, I don't know. Maybe I would. Well, but now you would? I would, but you, like, I don't get into altercation. So I usually try to get motherfuckers the one, like, if, I, if altercation with a nigga, like, yo, man, it's cool. You got it, bro. Let you chill. You can't, fuck you can't do that shit. to a stud because she'll start fucking calling you a pussy. I, she'll start doing everything. <laughs> well, <laughs> she's gonna get. She's Let's gonna get, get off on you. She's gonna get two before I haul off and hit her ass. What if she's gonna haul? Nah, off on I'm you. not pulling up on <clears throat> shit. What you if she's you? still off on you and she? Oh dazes no, she's you. still off on me. She better. She, she better dazes you. She, she dazes yeah. me. I'm fighting her. Like I'm in a fight for my life. You gonna hit her with like a weapon? Like I be in the dog. Sh- I'm dog walking this motherfucker. What so you she said the same shit I said? I'm biting her titties. <laughs> that's because you. That's hey hey. That's because you a freak. Yeah, I'm no. I'm that's what talking about. It's like I'm biting your titty. Hey, Kev I'm not, taking this. Kev I'm biting your titties out and biting, I'm biting your titties. Titty. <laughs> and we can't. And I'm wrestling. It's I'm a, losing. I'm move. grabbing a whole handful of nipple and twisting the shit out of that shit. It's a fight for my life. We are, nigga. We nah. brawling. So you say we that all, that means all yeah. bets are off, and she could grab your dick like uh, that. Are you yeah. like what's wrong? All with you, bets nigga? is off. She pull your shit nigga, right she off. She got now my what? nuts in my. She got her my nuts in her hand. I'm gonna have a whole nipple twist. One is worse. Like, you got a whole Are different right? idea of foreplay. One is worse, buddy. Yeah, all right. I'll be missing one nut. You be one nipple missing, bitch. Yeah, yours is worse. You be Way worse. <laughs> you be one miss. You have an eye patch over your nipple where your nipple used to be at. She'll be okay, <laughs> but you will be walking around with an empty sack. No, nah, I'm just saying, bro. If you That's hit it. me, if she hit me and I stumble, that means she hits hard. All the mad thing is to me is cover up, recover, and just straight drop this bitch. She kick you drop her. Nuts, Kev. It's a wrap. You ain't fighting Nothing. no more. Not, she don't bro. got a abide by man rule. She can kick you yeah. in your nuts. She can do uh, it. Uh, if she kicks it's you the, dead it's in the your nuts, fight. Kev, you might cry a little bit. Oh, uh, bro, I'm gonna cry. But you cry in the car. I'm, I'm, I'm gonna be in pain. My stomach gonna be hurting. But all I'm gonna be thinking about is ball up to recover. Me and this bitch fighting. Nah, they don't, we ain't breaking shit up. She's gonna leave. She's gonna take this dub. And you'll never see nah, her. Again. You ain't taking a dub. <laughs> you get in your car and leave because we fighting. Man, I tell you one thing. Yeah. Kev. To a woman, yeah, it, it, what, yeah, that, it does come with consequences. Listen, you if you a female and you still off on me, and I. Like a say stud. I stumble. A stud, okay. a stud, a stud, a stud, and I stumble because you stole off of me, and I'm trying to walk away from the situation. All right, you got to expect a real fight. You you got to expect the real fights coming. I'm not pulling no punches. I'm not laying up because you're a woman. I'm hitting you hard. Like I'm I'm making shit sound like back the ball crack. crack. Niggas gonna look at me like I'm crazy. Stop. You stole on me first. I'm trying to walk away from the situation. You just gonna get your hat. You stomp her out. I might, huh? You stomp her out. Yo, if she make me bleed, she might she might get a couple of kicks. Okay, you kick <laughs> women on the ground. Uh, man, this is she's, she's I ain't pregnant, gonna kick her hard. I right, you gonna get a couple to the stomach. <laughs> she ain't pregnant, man. She pregnant with gas. <laughs> no oh, time. oh, oh, you think studs can't get pregnant? I've seen that too. I know. I know niggas. That, listen, bro. Here, here's a funny story. You can't see any video for that. And I had. I remember. I remember this chick was a. She was a stud. She used to come to our crib and shit. When she came, she's always hang with us and chill. Care probably know who I'm talking about because he was around at that time. Oh my god! But she would always come to our crib and shit. And one time she came. We well, had a girl at the time. She came with like some tight jeans on. I'm talking about she ain't gay no more. Like uh-huh. trying to tip me to get some uh-huh. pussy. I'm looking at the jeans. I'm like, you know what? I'm looking at it like ass fat. Like, you know what? She got some tight jeans on. She do got some big ass titties. But then when you get to her neck and up, you realize you and this bitch is rocking the same Irison braids. Yeah, you. So, nah, it was hard for me to get past that. 
Them niggas was not. I think Kev was hitting that. Kev know what I'm talking Yo, about. <laughs> you are a fucking snitch, dog. Like, what I don't the care. fuck? He on the podcast. I would tell him I hit it because I was about to hit it. I was tempted. So, what? Kev, remember, oh, Kev you know, remember, it, remember right? the joint that used to come to our crib? The, the, the gay joint? She had a brother. It was her and her brother used to come chill at the crib. Niggas ran down or niggas ran a train on her. How she did I from, get dragged so into she went, wait, 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 wait. fantasies? She went from gay to Two now niggas. letting letting men run the train on her. Yeah, she got a train ran on her. Then she came around. So you're about telling she, me, hold on, hold on, hold on. She, she went this from is, you gotta gay. We like 17. She was 17. She went from gay to having men run the train. You know those are I'm not making Dre. I don't make shit up, Dre. That's a make fucking it. lie right there. No, I, you, want me to verify, you want me to verify this? I can make a fucking call right now and verify this shit. You want to make a call? I'll put it right on the podcast. Hey, Go ahead. Yo, I'm going to make the, make the call right Just say now. don't say no names. This nigga said, say no names. I don't make don't shit make up, Dre. You just made that shit up right there. No, the I didn't make, talk about? Look, nigga, nigga, I'm about to get this nigga in the call right now. See Go ahead. Go ahead. Call nigga right now. And yeah, I'll put him on the pod. I'll put this mic. Put the mic. Hopefully y'all can hear it. We'll see. See if this nigga answer. We'll see. This is what we I do hope now. this nigga answer. Cause, yo, bro, where K at, bro? You there? Yo, bro. I think it's on a cruise. Oh shit! Nah, he should be home by now. Yo, bro. <laughs> Niggas on an island. What the fuck? Yeah, you knew your lies was coming. Yeah, now my mind wasn't coming because I was about to put this shit on blast. Ke- Kev knew what happened. Dog, that is two extremes. Gay to, gay two. to getting a train ran on you is two yeah. very different extremes. She I was coming around. The she, with this thing, she was coming around the crib every day. Coming and around every said, day. I want all y'all. This is the this Kev no. This is the garage era. This is oh, when shit. we was having chicks come through. The, the garage was shit, the most wildest. Like Twenty years ago. Garage, man. <laughs> What was the, the original joint? garage band? Yeah, yeah. Ah, cause it was a um, it was another joint. They was girl, girlfriend and girlfriend. Mm. We ain't on a train down. A cat. Her name begins with a K. She used to live up the street from us in the P section. Yo, you don't have to do all that. I don't care, but she had a girlfriend. <laughs> we was all, we was all in the garage. Private, there's a Thank private you. chat. I know, but I'm just saying she she had a girlfriend with her. Like I watched. This is how I know she they this this is a different gay story. They were gay because they was eating each other pussy in the garage. And then I had my little brother Sammy slap the one chick on the ass. <laughs> wow. yeah, I don't know who that is, but I guess they hit the nail on the head. <laughs> they hit the nail on the head. Um that's crazy. That's crazy. To to me, do you hear they, the shit that Kev says? Yo, he says some crazy <laughs> shit. I have Sammy go in there and smack her smack on the ass. ass. <laughs> um, story. You are that's, an abusive person. One day, one day we're going to talk about how, like, what leads up to having to what leads up to running a train on a on a on a woman, like oh, yeah. the, the thought yeah, process, yeah. The conversations, mm. everything. One day we are going to mm. talk about that. What leads up to a train, and what do you, and what are the thought processes afterwards by everyone, the woman included. Mm. That's but really, good. the men. That's Listen, good. I'm a, all right. Real quick, real quick, real quick. I was involved in one train, <laughs> right? And one, the uh, one locomotive. <laughs> one locomotive. He was what there. That nigga? Uh, yeah. look, 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 we about to fuck his whole life. He was there. Yeah, he was there. Me. <laughs> that shit was the worst experience <laughs> I've had in my life. I said I <laughs> never want to be around men while I'm having sex or trying to have sex ever again. So I didn't like it. So that's why I, that's what I'm saying. I don't want to have sex with Oh, men. was that her it's, name? It's a turn off. This is crazy. I don't want to give up names. <laughs> like, what are we doing? <laughs> I didn't say the name. She got pregnant. Who's the daddy? All of us. We all going to it takes a village. Oh, but, yo, I think that was I think that was the show. Yo. Can't take it off the screen. Nah, because she was um. Like I said, she was gay. She she used to come around with the baggy jeans, everything with her brother every day and come chill with us. This month, oh, oh, she was her dog. brother name was was uh, his name was Kevin. <laughs> he said it, not me. You remember the you remember the chick I'm talking about? Yeah, she's always come to the crib. Yeah, I remember her brother. Did she not get a train ran on her? 
I don't know. You was yeah. there. My KB and all of them. Yo, yo, you might have been the conductor <laughs> on all yo, trains coming through Sickleville. Yo. <laughs> he was there. Because that, that nigga was there. That nigga <laughs> know he was there. <laughs> I wasn't there. I wasn't there. And I and I and I will never tell. I will never tell those niggas business ever. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I will Yo. never tell those niggas business ever. Yo, you know but she saying? meanwhile, she, Kev will tell the stories of their lives so everybody can connect the dots for them and then Oh yeah, you the one that your brother was talking about. Yo, you. but your <laughs> shit was funny because she she would come around with like she would just come around and chill and hang with us. She always had the baggy jeans or whatever. She was actually liking my baby mom at the time. She was trying to get at her, but she was my girl at the time. She was fucking with her, trying to get at her. This bitch just came one day. It was like, yeah, I ain't gay no more. I'm not. I'm just looking like my girl wasn't upstairs right now. Would I do this shit? You would have. Yeah, I was. I was. She's still a woman. You would have. Still a woman. They said she gave the best head ever. Niggas said they had it in that motherfucking garage. Just ran down on it. It was a bad situation. I guess she switched teams for the week. I don't know what she's doing now. But she just had. But the reason it was fucked up because she had the iris and braids. Like she just had the straight. (laughs) That's what fucked it all up. She had the 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 braids stopped like right here. So it wasn't like. It was girl braids. It was just the straight iris and braids. It was like you act like you never fucked a girl with iris and braids ever. Hey, Shit, that's because my, my wife had iris wig. and braids a little while ago under her wig, and guess what? That's because she I'm took the wig say. off. This chick was walking around like you know what I'm saying, like, but she was still talking yeah. like. Yeah, but that bonnet talk, on, I like. Think, I think what freaked Kev out is because she had a wave cap on when she told him. Nah, she she was talking. <laughs> she she sounded like Snoop from The Wire when she was talking to me. That kind of threw me off. It's like. <laughs> You don't fuck her voice. (laughs) (laughs) Shit is over. What is wrong with y'all, man? I'm just saying. Yo. You guys are shit. You guys are toxic. Oh my gosh. I'm just saying. It was just uh there's a lot of there's, yo, but listen, she switched teams for a week, man. She switched teams for a while. There's a lot of girls that switch teams. That switch teams in in mid season. You know what? I know some women who who switch teams and then switch back, yeah. but they to me they were they were women women though, like um, like they were like girly women. So to me, it's like that's permitted. The one thing that's <laughs> never permitted or never accepted is the man who switches teams and then switches back. Yeah. You don't want to talk about that, right? <laughs> niggas can't no, I'm just switch saying. Back. Niggas can't, can't switch, switch back. back. Niggas can't, can't switch back. back. Nah, you can't switch back. Niggas be like, man, I was doing all the fucking. All right. Remember that video that I, that I shared with y'all that you said was on the podcast? It said the nigga that was in the jail cell and told the dude, like, yo, he had consecutive lives. And he yeah. told the dude, his name was his name was a uh, sexual chocolate or some shit like that. Yeah, yeah. Or big, big chocolate. And he said, so yo, he, what'd he say? He said, nigga, you look pretty. Mm-hmm. Yeah, he's like, nigga, what you getting at? He said, nigga, you the closest thing I, I'm going to see to a woman. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? He said, he said, you going to run that? He going to say, you can get ready, man. You going to run that. Nigga, like, he said, what? He, he told him to get his butthole ready. Get it ready. I don't even know what that fucking means. <laughs> <laughs> I've never told my wife, yo, get your vagina ready. Like yo, get your vagina ready for me. It's like you it's kind of sitting there, you just sitting there with a Vaseline booty hole waiting for this big nigga to come with <laughs> take it. That is yo, the, man. The nerve because of big nigga, chocolate. That, <laughs> the nerve. I'm saying, because because the nigga said he said, nigga, we gonna have to fight. He said, I knocked plenty of niggas out. And they woke up. I knocked while I was while I was getting it, and I knocked their ass out again. I'm like, damn, man, that's scary gotta be a scariest shit I've ever That's gotta be the scariest the moment of your life. See, yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. See, here, read that. See, read there it. There you go. He I know who I'm story. talking about. I he was there uh, once or five, nigga. Once or five times is not yeah. like they're not close. Uh, once or five times <laughs> in the meadows. Um. Uh, who know who know I'm talking about? I don't know if I, I don't he know, know who I'm talking. He 
Because he was there at the garage days. Niggas was there at the garage days. I don't think y'all talking about the same thing. Right we, there. nigga, I think we are. Act, act like, act like we can see the person's name. You know what I'm talking I, about. That person doesn't know you. Now I'm about to show you. I'm about to tell who it is because the niggas watching from there. Look, look, listen, freak, bro. Yeah, that's that's freak. Cliff talking about that shit. <laughs> um, I never yeah, hit a stud. I never hit a stud, but I, I'm not saying I wouldn't. <clears throat> Oh, they, I know who you talking about. I know enough. who he talking about. He, he Cliff a little freak bull too. <laughs> have you yo, have y'all seen any like any studs worth fucking? Cause they're studs. Oh, yeah. There. Like, oh, yeah. I'm sorry. I, I, if I wasn't married or nothing like that, yeah, you could get it. And 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 I might love you after that. Was it? Wasn't on the press shoes. I might take you out to eat. We might, we might just have to date for a while. <laughs> one of us gonna drive the fucking um. One of us gonna drive the fucking Hellcat. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Both of y'all coming. Well, she Both of y'all showing can, up the niggas wet. Can y'all, can can y'all switch? Both of y'all showing up the niggas wet in the slacks and, and I'm the, and I'm the man. And she got a pussy. I'm fucking a pussy. Yeah, but I'm she's stuck in the ways. I don't. Nah, not with me. We could bring another girl into the bedroom. Let's do that. Like you could get freaky with her, like all right, yo, go grab, go bag her with your sexy ass. Go now bag I'm saying, her, like would, bring would you her be back. Mad? We all have fun. How about would that? Would you be would you be so, mad because she like never that. wear panties though? If if the pussy good, I don't care. So if you be where, cool where would you y'all. want where would you want under your fucking Jabo jeans or whatever the fuck? Y'all both it? wearing y'all both <laughs> y'all both in Walmart. Y'all both in Walmart grabbing briefs from different sections. She got the dickies. I don't give a fuck. What's hey, under yo. the dickies, nigga? Is it a fat ass? Is it a hey, body? Yo. If she got a body, yeah. then we, it don't matter. Hey, what's, the, what's the light skin stud? Bring that, that bald always... ass head. Bring them waves over here, bitch. Let me massage your scalp and tear you up, tear the bottom out your shit. The fuck is you talking about, man? <laughs> Only thing I gotta yo. figure out is if I'm gonna still eat ass or not, or eat pussy because it's gonna be a little weird. You know, yo, Ken, <laughs> you know, your girl say you look good after you get a haircut. That's how Drake was looking at his chick after she get lined up at the yeah, barbershop. Right. Damn, 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 like, damn, babe, I'm fucking call they, they, get a, they go to y'all appointment. Look. I don't, I don't call women babe, not even my wife. I don't call, I don't say damn, babe. I'm like, damn, babe, where you get damn who who yo who who faded you? That shit look crazy. That barbecue hey, yo, grab that together. fucking scout and fuck it. And then when you get done, she call you when you get done, she call you bro. <laughs> hey, I think bro. I'm okay with that. I think I'm okay with that. Come on. I think okay. Let me find a good looking stud so we can talk about it. Go ahead. <laughs> There's some good looking studs. The one that's on on I seen. She yeah. always be posting bitch. She thick as shit. You probably know what I'm talking about. Then thicker yeah, than a motherfucker. Yeah. Always, always doing the bird man John. Yeah, bring your ass over here. So, yeah. <laughs> bring your ass over here. Bring them hands. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, oh, you don't know what be like. This. I know the way you're talking about. You thinking shit? Hey, yo. come on, come on. Yeah, hey, clap them, clap them cheeks right the fuck up, nigga. You you gonna be moaning just like the rest of them? You know what I'm saying? Damn, bro. Damn, bro. Damn, Damn, like, bro. Hey, hey, yo, my nigga, you carrying this pussy up? <laughs> that shit crazy. I know. I know. <laughs> hey, yo. I, know. I, can't, I can't grab your hey, head. Yo. I grab the back of your motherfucking neck. Hey yo, <laughs> you sound you like Big John. Yo, Big John's nigga. Oh, <laughs> All right, case in point. The chicks, the chicks that was pretending to be to, pretending to be uh like studs on his shit. Oh, this yeah. is fine ass women. Oh, you mean to tell one? me you won't you you go ahead, go ahead. The light skin John, go ahead. Yeah, her, but it's the other one that's really gay, the real with Don't the big matter. titties. She cute, the one with the braids. Oh, yeah. Bring them all. <laughs> she got a vagina. <laughs> now you see what I'm saying. It's true. Only it is. Out is you gonna treat her like a woman? Because a woman, I, I, you know, you gonna eat, you gonna do, you gonna do your thing. Can you do the same with her? You just gotta give her straight thug loving, like just. She like, yo, she <laughs> grabbed it back. Yo, she grabbed it back. Yo, nigga, give me some head. You looking at a hey, bitch? Exactly. I say, I'm saying that. You just, <laughs> <laughs> your fucking hands, your fucking hands off me. Yeah, <laughs> my head. Bitch. What they call you now? Ray, your name is Rachel. <laughs> they call you Rachel. <laughs> Fuck off me, Ray. <laughs> I 
I'm here eating your pussy because I want to. <laughs> you ovulating yeah. too. So remember, you ovulating. You still ovulate, bitch. <laughs> but I'm saying, let me fuck up. She fucking good. And then she turned on 2K. Why you in the bed laid up? <laughs> I mean, I might be cool with that. Ask <laughs> yes, yes, away from me, bitch. I gotta go. You know what I mean? We about to get real crazy, but it's like you gotta think You're, about shit. At you your horniness. Make her a sandwich. Oh, I might yeah. pussy good. I might make her a sandwich. <laughs> this shit I do for my wife already. I already do shit like that. Like, what you want? You want some water? You want some this? You want? Some... Yeah, she fucked me good. Yeah, I'm gonna go make You're her a sandwich. Two K. Yeah. Why this nigga make a sandwich? <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> I'm just saying, man. I I don't want, listen. She was born a woman. Man. Technically, yeah. she was born a woman. Yeah. She's thinking about giving it back to you. You open them, yeah. open them cheeks. It's, just, it's the same same equipment there. Yep, niggas be looking I mean, at you like, yeah, like she she pretty. Her ass is fat. Yeah, she rock a fade. But who cares? Who cares? And Kev, let me ask you a question. She wants to do. Listen, all of us. No, nah, no. Nah, she wants nah, to do nah, Amazon nah. position. Nah, <laughs> she, nah, 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 nah yeah, he ain't fucking me like that. He doing it. If the pussy nah, good. You would do on vacation. Nah. We might go ahead and try that. <laughs> <laughs> International waters no. only. <laughs> I might go ahead. Yo, yo go ahead. See what you, see what you, see what you can do. Fuck it. <laughs> <laughs> no. oh, so we want that we want that thing do. Oh, no. <laughs> oh shit. Oh. oh man. Oh shit. Oh listen, man. That's all I got, yo. We just talking about this shit. Wait. Nah. Yes, nah, nah. No. 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 Nope. I mean, if no. if I know any if I know anything, that's just not my twist. I'm not saying that the people who do it is wrong. It's just not my twist. I, I like, yeah. you know, the natural when they pull out the what the, the juices when they pull out the the lube. I'm like, I'm a little dubious anyway. Like, why you gotta pull out that? You young enough to where your shit should still be pretty juicy. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm thinking about that shit because you can't make your own juices. Nah, yeah. you can't. So it'll be like, hmm. <sighs> yo. I bet you was probably cute as shit when you was a baby. Let me see some baby pictures. <laughs> Yo, how you go from the sincere to the serious? Face? You probably yeah. Cute. yeah, cause now, now I'm now I'm trying to figure it out. Sitting oh, <laughs> at the crib, like, damn, you said your mom had all her boys. You you adopted? Yeah, you adopted? Mm -hmm. Yeah, she look at your eyes all serious. Then what you gonna do? In the in the heat Man, of the listen, moment, everybody in that house getting beat up. <laughs> Why? They ain't lying to you. You like you I like hitting studs, beat nigga. The whole house up. If I found out you was a boy and all these baby pictures, I'm fighting everybody. That whole house is getting. Yeah, definitely going to jail. Hate, hate crime. Yeah. yeah, yeah, definitely. You going cool. down? You go down forever. Then you're gonna have to be in there with Big Rudy or, or Big Trevor. <laughs> <laughs> what? Get your bow ready. <laughs> yo, nigga telling you to get your bow ready is crazy. Yo. Like, hey, that gotta, gotta be the wild nigga right there. That gotta be the wildest sentence you heard in your life. And your whole heart to just drop like nice. what? Nah, the nigga could never sleep. I'm stabbing yeah, you first. I have to stab you. Your life sentence is the death sentence now. Uh, if you're okay. here, it's over. I'm, God, I'm will, un hey, God here. will understand. Yeah. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, yeah, man, man, we I'm out of here, man. Life. We got to wrap this shit up. This is wonderful. We tried to be serious this episode, but we ain't. No, we didn't. No, we didn't. Kev, you fucked all that up. Yeah. <laughs> Hey man, make sure y'all go check out um check us out on YouTube, man. That's the we we For sure. Yeah, we need y'all. We got all the clips, all this shit, man. All your comments gonna be all y'all comments is gonna be featured and everything. So, you know, make sure y'all plug in with us on YouTube and uh show us some love. Right. Share, like, yeah, yeah listen to us. And if you want to listen to us on the go, man, like I said, we on all major street platforms, Spotify, uh YouTube, um, music, all that shit. So podcast, Apple Podcast. So hey, check us out, man. We are yeah, man. I hope we made y'all weekend fun, man. Enjoy the rest of y'all weekend, man. Appreciate y'all tuning in with us. Peace. We out.